The New Jersey Festival of Ballooning takes off this weekend in Reddington. It's said to be the largest of its kind in North America. WFMZ's Callie Desimone is live at the Solberg Hunterdon Airport with a preview for us. Callie? Good evening to you, Rob. Well, the festival actually started way early this morning. Things are a little bit on edge right now. That's because there's a couple of raindrops that are coming down. There's a lot of people out here and they're just crossing their fingers because at 6.30, the first set of balloons are expect to, expected to go up for the night, but it's not clear if that's going to happen. It's all just gonna have to depend on the weather. Organizers call it the largest hot air balloon festival in North America. Once again, the quick check New Jersey Festival of Ballooning is soaring to new heights this weekend. There's a hundred balloons of all different sizes and shapes coming from around the country and around the world. This year marks the 35th anniversary of the festival and more than 150,000 people are expected to attend throughout the weekend. Uh, this is my first year coming here with my husband and we like to go to balloon festivals. Sarah Bozer and her husband traveled from Holland, Pennsylvania for the festival. Of all. They're here because of their love of photography. It's fun to take pictures of balloons because they're colorful and it's kind of a joyful event. There's a beautiful sky today for it. There are clouds, big white clouds. So that's a great backdrop. Others who are at the festival today say there is something magical about watching the balloons inflate before soaring into the sky. But they are happy keeping two feet on the ground. That I'm glad I'm not on it. <laughs> I mean, I love watching them, but glad I'm not on it. And for those who don't care for high there's plenty to check out on the ground, including food, shopping, and rides. And speaking of other things to do while you're out here, rock legend Pat Benatar will be here tomorrow night. Another popular band, especially with the young folks, is Plain White Tees. They will be out here this weekend as well, so you can check them out. For more information about the Balloon Festival, you can log on to our website, WFMZ.com. There's much more information, including ticket prices there for you to find. For now, reporting live, Callie Desimo, 69 News.